my time zone when my mind's gone and I'm flying home and I'm stressed out and I'm tempted to get that style phone and go pull it up but you know what's up and you know that ain't gonna solve nothing I mean Lord forbid I might follow something and I'm all another cuz to hold me down like bitch straps to the sight ward it's killing me but you still with me when I fight hard and Digging me when I'm eating you Deal with me when my car's pulled Could've dealt with me But you fell for me Before I fell for you Keep me on that right path And the right math Is you plus nothing's everything You my everything Same You ain't gotta question my allegiance Cause the way you love me I can never leave I need you By my side Thick and thin Highs and lows Don't let go How did I fall in this? No condition that get a mention, but you offer this Unconditional love, I swear I sell it all for this Trying to keep it together, forget my awkwardness But I'm um, off in this, just you and me off in this Family the shadows and I know they trying to pick me off in this You say that all whites are racist. Can you ex expound on that, please? Any, any white person who was born, raised, and schooled in the United States of America, if you aren't a racist, you're a miracle. Either that or you decided to educate yourself. Because education in this country is about white is right, brown's all right, black's got to stand back. Yellow's mellow, but whites, we, we educate in a way that says that white males have done all the adventures, have made all the adventures, have done all the discovering, have made all... And, Everything that is good and has been accomplished has been accomplished according to social studies, which is actually anti-social studies, by white males. It's a lie. But we do that in order to maintain the myth of white superiority. The myth of race has to be maintained at all costs in this country. Because if white people have to give up the color of their skin as being something that makes them perfect, what do they have left? If we start teaching the truth about history, if we start teaching about Nile Valley contributions to civilization, it will totally change the way we conduct ourselves in the classroom. It will have to. Columbus didn't discover America. You can't discover a place where people are already living. But we celebrate that every October. It's a lie. We need to get over, we, we need to stop telling the myths and start telling the truth. So when you tell people that they're racist, and it, it must have some kind of effect because most people will say, I'm not racist. I'm not a racist. Why, some of my best friends are black. Right. Yeah, and then you say, name one. <laughs> or this one, I don't see color. And when some woman says to me, I don't see color, I say, I knew that if you saw color, you wouldn't dye your hair that way. Or I say, if you, didn't, if you saw color, you wouldn't wear that shirt with those pants. I believe that you don't see color. It's an attempt to deny skin color and it's attempt, an attempt to deny what's wrong with seeing the color of my skin. Is it all right for you to see me kind of pink? That's okay for me, I don't mind, I, and I suspect that you don't mind being seen the color you are. You have a right to be what you are. And until people in this country and people in this world get it into their heads that the first modern human beings that evolved on this earth were black women. They evolved in sub-Saharan Africa about 280,000 years ago. And every human being on the face of the earth today runs the has the memory of those black women's genetic structure in their genes. Now, we don't want to admit that, but that's the way it is. Long ago, we used to have a paper at the master sitting by the neighbor. You have to have a paper and don't take it. You can get lynch. Today, I don't know to walk about free till the lady carrying your pocket and so on and so forth. We are not just humping a little pillar if you get a passport and go. But you can't go nowhere and stick. The other nations can come here and set up shop here and nobody bothers them. The Chinese, the East Indian, the Caucasian, the Japanese, they all come here in this land and set up shops and rule over our people. Because all these businesses from, from San Diego, Grande come down to Point fourteen, wherever you want to go. It's owned by one people, sir. Other races, give it up to the Bible. I'm not sure who won it. Why you have this one? Book of Deuteronomy. 28th, Angles 1447. 48th, Angles 1447. 
47, yeah. 47, yeah. 48. I'm just 47. Uh -huh. Because thou servest not the Lord thy God. Because we do not serve the Lord our God. When he said thy God, he means your God. God is the God of Israel. That's right. And none else. Yeah, you can read the Bible from start to finish. You can only find yeah. what God said. I am the God of Israel. The churches tell you God loves everybody. They teach us that. But tell them to bring a scripture out of God's word to say that there is not one. They were jumping to John 3 16. For God so loved the world. The word, world, many different meanings. Many different meanings. Listen to this. Because sometimes, because we are we are big men and so on and so forth, we tend to think that what we have learned, nobody has to really teach me now. But I, I really reach far with it because I did not I did not know that this image was not Christ though as a big man. I found out recently that this is the one of the biggest lies on the face of the earth. It's a lie. Because they told us Christ, by showing you picture, they're telling you Christ why then? Correct, try right, to Right. What text you have here on our head as a people? The Negro rich, what text are here? Revelations 1 and 1. What text are here? Well, you call it clearly here. Our here is you find that in your dictionary, if you Google it, anywhere you go. And you ask what type of here Negro people have under here, head? You were here woolly here. A woolly here people like all these sheep and the moons. All praises. Read that. Hear what Jesus Christ have under here. One and one. Revelations one and one. The book of Revelation, chapter one and verse one. Ah. The revelation of Jesus Christ. The word revelations, my brother, means the revealing. The revelation of who? The revelation of Jesus Christ. The revealing of Jesus Christ. What Christ look like. Read Galatians 14. Verse 14. Ah. His head and his hair. Jesus Christ's head and his hair. He and his face were white, white like in wool. color. Like what? Like wool. White in color and woolly in texture. How white it was? As white as snow. As white as snow. Now we know that wool comes in different colors. We have the we have brown, we have black, we have the white. So he makes sure to tell you how white Christ had here was as white as wool. Yes, Christ, skin complexion. Go. And his feet, uh -huh. like unto fine brass. When the prophet looked down at Christ's feet, is your feet the same color with your body, brother? All praises to the most high. So if you're on black, your feet will be black, red. And his feet, like unto fine brass. Like unto fine brass. As if a lot of brass, my brother. Did you, did, what is the word? Derivative. The 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 wrong. Right. What is your color, sir? Are we truly black? I have a black pants and black boots. Look at my boots and look at your hand. Dark wrong. Dark wrong. We are brown. We're not really black. You're just a black man. But we are not black. We brown skin and complexion. But, but something, wait, something, yeah. is, something is contradicting. Tell me. Okay, we are not black. We are dark brown. But they call us black. But go ahead. But, but yeah, from the black race. From the black race. Yeah. Which black race? Black race. Black race. Yeah. I am not Caucasian. No. There's nothing wrong in saying black, you know, because like for instance, do you know what the word nigger means? Nigger means black. It means black. Yeah, by the word. That is not a word. No, in Detroit, I mean. But that's what it calls right through. Okay, you understand? You understand? Do you know the word nigger is in the Bible? 
Because you, you hear what you just say. Yeah, but that's good. We don't use that word, but God uses it. Bring it. Because everybody thinks that everybody in the world belongs to God. That's false. This man, and just now, this man and his people set him up as God after doing this to us and destroying us mentally, taking us and not educating us, then they can feed you this and say that is Christ. So if you are worshiping this as Christ, guess what the white man you see fucking the road is? That is a God. Because we're worshiping him in the first place. So the majority of us is because you are our people, is eh? If a white man is walking through here, we send up your men. We will move for him to pass. That's how our, our people is moving. If a black man is walking through a crowd of young black men, for a place it's wrong, they can pass over. But they would allow the white man to pass. Because why? Years of brainwash. But here it's written. The book of Acts, chapter 13 and verse 1. This whole Bible, all the prophets were black. Christ was black. That's God right. God is black. Good. That's right. Read. Book of Acts chapter 13 and verse 1. Uh -huh. Now there were in the church that was at Antioch uh -huh. certain prophets. Certain what? Prophets. The only prophets they ever had in life was the prophets of the Most High God, which came from the lineage of Israel. That's right. The only prophets was us, not the Caucasian race or any other race. Read. Certain prophets uh -huh. and teachers uh -huh. as Barnabas uh -huh. and Simeon uh -huh. that was called Nega. What? That was called nigger. That's in the Bible. That was called nigger. That is a bad word. That was called nigger. We read in the Bible. Let me read. King James Version Bible. Wait. That was. What is the meaning of the word? I just told you. The word nigger means black. Everybody uses. Because Latin it for, us. for black. They, 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 Negro they. is Spanish for black. Yeah. All right, Israel. Right. It was a Bible. Just get by with it. Let me show you that in the Bible. Oh, yeah, all stands for Deuteronomy chapter 20. That's one of the curses in the Bible that was and put on us. And thou shalt be God and a son of God. Now, this year, God is speaking to the children of Israel to a child's side. Yeah, but wait. God made man. Of course. And his own likeness, yes. What do you have to become of what has become of them? God made them, they are not his people now. God made the God made the East Indian, God made the Chinese, God made the white man. He made everybody correct. But did God choose a people? Did God choose a people? No, you know answer me yet. I want to ask you. Did God choose a people? Because here what God said about the Israelites. Should I give it up in Deuteronomy 6 and 7? Deuteronomy chapter 7 and verse 6. Here what God tell the Israelites. For thou art an holy people. God say, you all, you Israelites, you black man and black woman, are a holy people. Holy means separate, so special, read. Unto the Lord thy God. Unto who? The Lord thy God. God himself say, you are a special people unto me. Read. The Lord thy God. The Lord thy God, your God, read. Have chosen thee. Now he choose everybody. Thee. No, God made everybody. Thee. But I God loved everybody. Thee. He had chosen thee. He chose you, brother. He chose you, brother. He chose you. He chose us as a people, read. To be a special people. A special people. Okay, as, let hold let on. Let him finish it. Hold on. Let him finish it. To be a special people. To be a, we are a special people unto who? Himself. So God say, you all are special unto me. Yes. I choose you. Go ahead. Above. Wait, wait. There's, there's more. Above. Above all people. Above what? All people. Above all people. That are upon the face of the earth. Yes, God chose us yeah, and only. Us. Yes, he made everybody else. Not understanding that he chose. But you believe in God's words, though, right? Certainly. So, but this is God's words. Sir. Mm. It's oh. not my words. I'm telling you what God no. said. But um, what, what, what you're saying is um, maybe... no, not what I say. What the Bible says. Yeah. Okay, no, because um, you can put it in your own meaning. All right, do me a favor then. Do me a favor. One second. Yes, you really think it with me? Okay, okay. Please. Don't think it with me. Don't have any passion in me. Don't take it for 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 no for my eh? I love you. Trust me. You're my brother. And you're my brother. The most I live it, I love your minds. I love minds, and I speak proud when I say I love minds. Right. Deuteronomy 
No, they are not. We have the Hispanics. I know, I know. We have the Native Indians. So they do look like other races. It's not only the Negro man the most I got come from. He only came for though the 12 tribes of Israel. That's what Christ wow. come from. Exodus chapter 2 and verse 25. Uh -huh. And God looked upon the children of Israel. Upon the children of who? Of Israel. You see the most I got only looking at something, me. Something there, something. Why? God look upon the children of Israel. Yes. Who he has chosen. That is his people. What about the other people? Why are you so concerned about that though? Nah, we you had know, a, you're not concerned about no that. No one has just where's going on us. You're not concerned that we had a bike by food on every other nation. No, no, no. You're not concerned about our sisters. Yeah, what yeah, about the other people here yeah, now? You're not concerned. Point, don't pass. But listen. No, I'm gonna give you the answer. Remember I told you we speak with the Bible? You ask a question, brother. Could you allow me to answer with the Bible? Okay. All praises, bring it in the Bible. This is the apocrypha. Hear about the other people. This is the apocrypha. These are 14 books that were taken out in the late 1600s. This was in the original translation of the King James Version Bible. Right? Well. Book of Second Ezra, chapter six and verse fifty-four. Uh -huh. And after these, Adam also, uh -huh. whom thou madest Lord 
over all thy creatures. Did God do that? Yes. Make Adam a Lord, Lord over all creatures. Read Of him come we all. Didn't we all come from Adam? Yeah. All persons, really. And the people yeah. also. Wait, wait, stop. Wait, stop. wait. No, no, no. Let him throw the people. Go ahead. And no, the wait, people wait. also. also uh -huh. Whom thou hast chosen. God chose a people. So yeah, did God yeah, make everybody? I want you to go back where you said that. Read it over. Okay. He's going back. He's okay. going back. Okay. And after no, these, yeah, go ahead. Uh -huh. Adam also, uh -huh. whom thou madest Lord over all thy creatures. All. all. He wait, made him Lord. Wait, wait, wait. wait. All. Not only the No. Right. Go ahead. <laughs> of all. Him. All. Yeah, yeah. Listen, listen, listen. Of listen. him come we all. So everybody came from Adam. That's right. Correct? Okay. Great. Great. Okay. And the people also. The people also. What does that mean? The people also. No, you had to ask God that. You ready? Let me explain. Listen. You go and read it. Listen, wait, wait, listen, wait, wait. listen, listen. And you're asking me. which people? He's going to tell you God talking to you. Listen. Read it. And the people also. And the people also. The, the, also. the other people. The separate people. The word also signifies separation. Yes. yes. Yes, right yes, right. Also, because the children of Israel was set aside for the rest of the spirit. I love your bright. Keep telling you that. Read. And the people also, uh -huh. whom thou hast chosen, who thou hast chosen, read. And this have I spared before thee. Yeah. Oh Lord, because thou made us the world for our sake. For whose sake? For our sake. For our sake. God made the world. For the Israelites sake, because from Genesis to Revelation, the only people that you can find God speaking to is the same rebellious, wicked Negro man and one today. That's right. God only spoke to the Israelites. That's right. Other nation on the face of the earth that God speak to when in this Bible read. As for the other people, as for the other people, which also no, the people that He chose, answer, but as right for the people. other people, you have to answer and explain why they do that. So why don't you be a man if you have something to say and confront? Yeah, but why you don't confront if you're a man? Yeah, but you're staying long in the back. That's bad, though. Hey. Be a man. Just let him finish it, bro. He finish, he finish, he finish. As, as for the other people, as for the other people, as for the other people, which also come of, from Adam, which is Adam. everybody else, brother, that came from Adam. So I said, that there are nothing. What God said, that there are nothing. God Other people? is a racist, yes. God That's said that right. there are what? That there are nothing. Read. But I like <laughs> unto spittle. I like unto what? Unto spittle. What is spittle, sir? What? Spittle. What is that? Say it again. But I but be like unto spittle. He said they are nothing. They like spit. That's what God said. Read it. And has likened the abundance of them all uh -huh. unto a drop. Unto a what? Unto a drop. Unto a drop that fell it from a vessel. That fall out from I give you talking water, sir. And a drop fall out your bucket. Would you worry about the drop? I can't read it because I can't pick it up. Well, all praises, but that's how God feels about the others, too. Okay. Nowhere in this Bible could you find where Romans God said, and seven. He chose the Israelites. You know what's confusing yeah, yeah, about that? Yeah, 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 Can I tell you something? You know what, what confuses me about that? Though? Have you ever asked the other nations why they treat your people that bad? When you were serving this man, you ever question it? No. Never question it. Never question it. But today, I never serve you. But today, oh really? Really? You knew what Christ looked like? Did you know what Christ looked like? No. What if you didn't know what Christ looked like? What if, but from a child, what if it, your great 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 grandmother, your great 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 grandfather had only known him as Christ. Christ was a black man. Okay. Christ was a black man. That's, That's right. right. Christ, Jesus Christ, and the Lord God of Israel are black. That's right. The angels in heaven are black. The Job, black. Okay. King Solomon, black. The Israelites, black. That's right. But people think that this book Bible is all inclusive. A book that this that has made was made and put in statement you know, you are a special people. That should make you sweat and jump for joy. Because all your life. You have been told that you are nothing, you're a nigger, 
we know good, we can do nothing. When you look at yeah, nothing. Yeah, when you look yeah, at yeah, nothing. Yeah, it's a day you find out that Christ look like you. The only nation of people where the woman just try to change the looks is our people. Our women, Negro women, want to look like the Chinese and the Japanese and the white women. They all is buying here to look long and stringy like them. When Christ here on his head, just like they are. That's a destroyed people. Give me that. My people are destroyed our team that long time. Hosea 4 and 6. Hear yeah, what God said about his people. Listen to this. And give me that. Isaiah chapter um, 20. Yeah, the Oxford is one and the Asses Masters. Give me that. One second. Remember what I was telling you, right? We must always allow God to speak. Because if I'm telling you my own words, brother, shut me down, walk away, turn on me. I'm telling you what God said. Read. But all Read. The book of Isaiah, chapter 1 and verse 3. Uh -huh. the, ox know, the ox know it is owner. The most like God say an ox. An ox is a dumb animal. He knows his owner. And the ass his master script, another dumb animal, a jackass. He knows where his owner lives. He knows his master's crib. Read. But Israel, but you black men and black women, you are the Israelites. That not how you don't know. My people that not be set up. Look at us. We walk in the walking path. Because of that white. And the way she is saying, this is more a better depiction of what Christ would look like. We are not saying this is Christ. According to the Bible, Christ is black. Christ is only here just like you. Nobody, that person, ain't stopping to say, all right, we're here. Because all our life, we have been worshiping this devil. If you see Christ coming in the morning, when you look up, you see a white man coming out of the cloud, run. We are going back in slavery. But hear what the kind of hear what I said. Give me that. The yeah. book of Daniel, chapter 7 and verse 9. The Christ, the Christ here, when you see me, you see the Father. All praises, read. I beheld till the throne were passed down. Uh -huh. And the ancient of days is set. The ancient of days is God Himself. Read. Who's that? And, and the next thing people like, God is a spirit. So you have to worship. We can sit on your butt. Did God make us in His image and likeness? Do we sit on our butt? Do we wear clothes? He had on garment. Read. And the ancient of death that said, ah. whose garment, whose garments he had on clothes, read, was like, was white as snow. All praises, read. And the year, no, they're describing the year on the most high God. This is supposed to make you jump, bro. All your life you think God, God and um, white. The angels white, no. blind bastards, no. read. And the year of his head, the year on God head, like the pure world. Pure world is your hair, bro. Pure world is my hair. But there were no pastor who didn't teach you that. No pastor, you know why? Anytime a pastor start to push that in this church, they're going to shut him down. That's right. The pastors is angels for the white man. That's right. The pastors is bandits. Literally robbing you with out a gun. Only smooth words. They will come tell you, come to church. Our pastors have women walking the road with pants every day. Coming to church with pants. And you have a God say. You may not in the Bible. You will never find a pastor telling a woman, you're not supposed to wear pants. You may not The book of Deuteronomy, <laughs> chapter 22, and verse 5. Ah. The woman, God is talking to the woman, shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. Read. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. We know that is cross dressing. Yeah, did you see a man come across your own here? In a dress for a skirt. They were scorning it. They were looking for the hair with a smile, yes? But that is how God see a woman in pants. That is cross dressing. It's an abomination according to the Lord. Read. For of Israel. Read. For all that do so uh -huh. are abomination. It's unto the Lord our God. It's an abomination, brother. The most high God gave us laws, statutes, and commandments. And if we do not follow them, we get what? Judgment. Now give me that in 47. Give me 28. Verse 47. Here we go. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28. And verse 47. Yeah. Because thou servest not the Lord thy God with joyfulness and with gladness of heart. Because, like, for instance, today is what? Today is the beginning of the Most High God's Sabbath. That's right. There is to be no buying and selling on the Sabbath. That's 
right. But you know what? The, 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 the heads, the power, so bright. You know what they do? They pay a chest of the eve of the Sabbath. And black man, greatest weakness is money in his hand. He work whole week and then on the Friday evening, he only wants to spend it, drink it, and run down on a little woman. He can't wait to give back the other nation his money. He can't wait to go in KFC. He can't wait to go in True Value. He can't wait to go in the park. You understand what I'm saying? Do you read it? For the abundance of all things. Because we are we're not serving God with joy in our heart for the abundance of what? Of all things. Because God made the world for Israel's sake. That's right. Sake. We were the kings and priests of this world. Right. We were supposed to be ruling these other nations. But right. Right. we broke the laws of God and he put us in slavery. He put us in slavery. Read it. Therefore, shall thou serve thy enemies. Therefore, we shall serve the East Indians, the Chinese, the white man, the Arab, the Japanese. We shall serve our enemies. Yes. God didn't say your friends. Wait, sir. Wait. Hear God. Hear God. Thine enemies. What God said? Thine enemies. One more time, let me Thine enemies. It's not your friends. Because we are servants to all the other nations on this earth. Read. That's right. Which the Lord shall send against uh -huh. in uh, hunger and grace. Which who? In hunger. No, who send them against us? Which the Lord shall send against Who put us in slavery? Which the Lord shall send against me? Who allowed the other nations to rule us? Which the Lord shall send against me? God send them against us. Read. In hunger and hunger, my brother. My brother. When you're hungry, where do you want to buy your meat? Literally? Literally. I do not buy meat. All right, where do you buy your things to prepare your meals? Grocery. And who control that? Well, the conglomerate. The other nations. Because God said you shall serve your enemies in hunger. KFC, Royal Castle, True Value, Subway, you name it. You name it, bro. We buy our foods from our enemy. Thus said the Lord God of Israel. That's right. You shall serve your enemy for food, go ahead. And in test, and in test, there is no butter company in this country owned by a Negro man. That's right. There is no water system owned by our people. As a matter of fact, they're going to river and some man was too long to charge. You can't be taught to no buckets of water out of God River. We shall serve in test. Read. And in nakedness. In nakedness. We used to be in the cotton fields. We was in the cotton fields. Yet, we don't own no fabrics. We, you, me, our yes, forbearance, the black man. our the black man. The black man yes, okay. read. The black man is the Israelites. That's read. Right, that's right. And in once of all things, and in anything you want, brother, you have to go to your enemy, thus said the Lord God of Israel. Anything you want, birth certificate, death certificate, doctor, you name it, you have to go to them, read. And he shall put a dog, <coughs> go slow, go slow, and he shall put a yoke of iron a dog color a yoke of iron is a dog color on thy neck did this happen to us as a people yeah. that's in the bible the bible is our history book the bible is not a religious book what is the solution to end that all, all praises. praises to the most high god that is the most intelligent question ever here in south The we have plenty of I know, I know. Oh. I want you to come in front of you and stand in back and try to. I know you like Baptist. Yeah, but your religion comes from the white man too. Oh. After, after, after this, after after this, this I'm going yes, to come back. Yes, brother. <laughs> they gave us all that. After yes, this, after I know. This, I have to come back, sir. All praise. But hear this. Go ahead. Why after this we're going to try again? The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 10 and verse 12. Let me ask you something. When you go there, you're going to learn anything about Christ? Anything? Just now, just now. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 10, and verse 12. And now, Israel. Now you ask what? You better ask what? You better ask a question. What must we do? What is the solution for the country? we are in as a people what must we now do to get out of this state nobody will like it get but i'm going to bring it real and now that is the number one right there brother that's number one get together in christ that's under right. christ nothing folly read and now israel uh -huh. what does the lord thy god require of 
we, what does God require of you? What does God want you to do? But to fear the Lord thy God. To do what? To fear the Lord thy God. Fear the Lord your God. Fear God. If we have feared God in the beginning, we would not have been here today. Read. To walk in all his ways. To walk in all the ways of the Most High God. Meaning, you must be keeping the commandments of God. If God said today the Sabbath, go back to it. God said women are to be in pants, don't do it. Should I use it? Okay. He said it's okay, yeah. The most High God gave us law, statutes, and commandments to keep. Like for instance, a simple commandment is like free baby. God told us to do that. Go ahead. Grow your hair. To love him. And to do what? And to love him. Do you know what is the love of God, sir? Do you love God? Do you, you have to do what? That, that is the love of God. Because the, the church's teacher just love Jesus and the pastor himself gay. The married and gays. The pastor is abandoned. The pastor sex any men in the church wives. The pastor have two, three women in the church. The laws of God will teach you don't do that. Marriage is honorable in all. Should we turn a blind eye? Turn a blind eye on what? Ezekiel chapter 3 and verse 7. I'm giving you this. I'm giving you this. You think if we leave it alone, God will judge them and we read. You believe that is right? Because if you see your brother crossing now, you see that he's your brethren. Ready, guy? He's your brethren, right? If you see him going down the road, you're drunk and crossing the road, kill us. And I can't come in, but speak. Would you leave him? What you would do? You run and move him. Because that's your brethren, right? Well, you see this here? This is my brethren. So here what God tell me to do with my brethren. The Read. book of Ezekiel chapter 3 and verse 7. These are my brethren and my God sisters. Read. Son of man, uh -huh. I have made you a watchman. The most High God say he made you and you and you and all we see doing this. A watchman unto who? Unto the house of Israel. Unto my people. I am speaking to my people. Whoever gets offended, just don't stand up and listen. Because we never had nobody to speak for us before. But we, as the men of God, come to speak for our people. That's what right. God said. Be a watchman to your people. Read. Therefore, uh -huh. hear the word of my mouth. Read it over. Hear the word at. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth. Hear the word at my mouth. The mouth of God is the Bible. So God is saying. Hear the word of my mouth, black man, read it. And give them warning from me. Give warning. Who God said to give warning? Them. Them. Tell our sisters come out of the pants. Christ come and meet you like that, he will kill you. Tell our brothers to stop being homongers. If you're sexy, the woman marry her. Stop having fatherless children. That's why the crime rate are you. Stay home and see out your children, black man. That's right. What do you think? Yeah. 
we speak with authority. That's right. Because we are ready to defend the word of God. So you know what I mean? He is going to defend us. That's right. We don't worry to put the hands to nobody. They can't touch us because the most high God running the show. Not the officers, not the soldiers, nobody, not the government. God running this, read. That's right. I'm sure my people. That's your possessive God is. He didn't say show everybody in the world enough. God says show my people. Their transgression. Show you your transgression. You know what transgression is? Your sin. So brother, find this be a different. That's what God says, show you your sin, right? Bring it. You're not fully well today, it's Sabbath. What are you supposed to be doing? So now you have no more excuse because you know the word of God say today the Sabbath of the Most High God. I'm showing you your sin, read. The Pentecost chapter 21 and verse 1. And that I said, read. They shall not make boldness. Do not make boldness like my country on the ship. I'm all your head. Upon the head. Don't ball your head off. Neither shall they shave off the corner of their bed. Throw your beard, it's a manly thing. The, 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 the dictionary this says that the beard is a badge of manly dignity. Right. You can never find a male like a lion trying to stretch out the beard. A lion is where that thing proud. It makes him look big, it makes him look mean, powerful. Only a female is known. It's not the It's known. Because why are speaking loud? It's because I'm speaking loud. You understand? The female is known to be smooth. Then bald head and bald face is an Egyptian custom. That That's right. The Egyptian, according to God, is garbage. That's right. God chose only the Israelites. Those people that put us in slavery, the black people in Africa, they are not our people. Second Chronicles 14 and 12. That's the Lord God of Israel. We have something else. Continue reading. When I say unto the wicked, so this is we going back into Ezekiel here. God said, When I hear watchman unto the house of Israel, he said, When I say unto the wicked, thou shalt surely die. You brother, if you continue in your ways, you're going to die. In your sins. You know the right thing, do it. Because to know and still do bad, there's no more repentance from that. Second really? Chronicles 14. And thou givest them not warning. So if we didn't come out here to call to our people and tell them, look man, you are the greatest thing that ever walked here. That's right. The most high God is your God and nobody else is God. Every other nation is going to have a God looking like you. Now speak to one the wicked, but if we didn't warn our people from so his wicked way, if you was listening, now you was listening. More than all the scriptures, you need to listen to this one. Read it over. When I say unto the wicked, read it over. Sorry, son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. So he tell us he make us watchmen. I don't care who stand up and listen. I come to speak loud, and, and, and they're going to hear. So when judgment day comes, nobody will have an excuse. Read. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth. Hear the words at my mouth. And we don't like the pastors. Set up a big building to make people come in and sit down for hours to listen to talk garbage and then pay out your tithes. We don't want nobody money here. We will never come here and ask somebody. We don't give a damn about your money. Because every one of us have a job. Oh, the youngest one go right. Because God said for man don't work, he shouldn't eat. So we teach our men, get a job. That's right. How the hell you could want a wife and you're broken? You're an idiot. Read. And give them warning from me. So we here to warn our young men for God. And the older ones warn you that the most high God is about to enter on this earth. And when he come, he's going to destroy you. Read. When I say unto the wicked, uh -huh. thou shalt surely die. But you're, you are surely going to die for your wickedness. The wages of sin is what? And sin is what? Sin is... No, what is sin? We ain't get that from here. Bring that from 
Chris Young Chen. You must sit somebody fast. You love it? You must sit. But the pastor will tell you, stop sinning. And ask the pastor what is sin, pastor. He will, don't worry about it. God is love. Sin is good against the commandments. All praises. Read it. Look up the first verse. Chapter 3 and verse 4. This is sin, people. For who don't know? Read it. Whosoever committed sin, uh -huh. transgress it also the law. Who commits sin, transgress it also the laws of the most high God. Read it. For sin uh -huh. is the transgression of the law. Sin is transgression of the law. Like what?
So many youths, them have potential. Yet still, them never get proper education. How come granny never get no pension? It look like them young people working for Satan. Politics is a trick, so systematic. And no poor no benefit. Only rich is getting rich. I can see the economical prejudice. Oh, my advice is this. Don't put your life at risk. Make them fight it, road boy. Don't be them sidekick. Make them fight it, all they must fight it. Make them fight it, all they organize this your world crisis, this your world crisis. So hard to survive is because of those same big neck guys Who are only seeking powers to ruin our life Politics is a trick, so systematic And no poor no benefit, only rich is getting rich I can see the economical prejudice No equal rights, no justice, my advice is this Make them fight it, road boy, don't be them sidekick Make them fight it, them alone no sidekick So open up your eyes now, John Public, and see who is the culprit at the pulpit. At the institute, economic prejudice. At the mafia money in a them pocket. At the metal madman turn over rubbish. Them say slavery abolished, but them still are used to it. And a long time, the Rasta man tell you about it. Make them take off them tire, take off jacket, make them roll up them sleeve, knock face to face, make them draw fee by pion, and pick a stick, John Psalm 35, and make them vanish, make them fight, make them fight, make them fight, make them fight it, road wide, don't be them sighted, make them fight it, come on, we must fight it, make them fight it, or they mark a noise, this ya will fly, this this ya will fly. We make them fight it. Get yourself out of the way, make them fight it. Cause we know business, we need make them fight it. And we know run the rocket, make them fight it. Don't put your life at risk, make them fight it. Come out of the way, make them fight it. Get yourself out of the way, make them fight it. We know business, we need make them fight it. <laughs>